DMC is doing a full carbon fiber 570S McLaren after a few words of introduction. Hi guys, thanks for tuning in again. It's really awesome to see you guys uh, coming here every week to look at our channel. If you are here for the first time, welcome of course. And also hello to our crowd on Instagram. If you're not following us yet, please do so at DMC Luxury. In today's video, we're gonna have a look at a new project that we're doing. It's gonna be a full carbon fiber McLaren 570S. Um, of course, tuned and redesigned by DMC. And um, basically in this video, we're gonna show you the first step, how we are doing a 3D scan of the car and also doing some first design steps. If you wanna skip forward to that video or wanna see directly where we're doing the 3D scan, I'm gonna blend in the time frame over here or uh, you can just wait for a few words of my introduction. I'm just gonna tell you a little bit how we came to this project. So basically um, this project came to life just about four to five weeks ago. And we're really excited about that because it's a project that is reintroducing DMC brand to Thailand. Um, now, what are you talking about, Greg? DMC is already in Thailand, isn't it? Well, sort of, but in, DM in Thailand, we have so far been doing mostly the car hotel. Uh, that project was called CMC. Okay, Greg, but um, hold on. Haven't you done at least a project already for the McLaren 570S? Yes, true, but all the parts that we did so far were let's say it was more like a stage one kit. We did a wing, we did some add-on parts, but we haven't done really anything crazy yet. And if you know DMC for a while, then you know that every now and then we're gonna do some limited editions and um, we're gonna call it Edizione GT. Edizione GT are the projects where we basically give our engineers a green card to do whatever they want, um, no matter how expensive or far-fetched it is. If this is a really awesome project, which sets new milestones, uh, is even a little bit crazy. We don't even look at market acceptance. If it's something really crazy, then we do it under the Edizione GT label from DMC because this is what we really, really, truly love doing. Sure, every company has to do some um, commercial products. That's what we do with our regular body kits. But with Edizione GT, we go really over the top sometimes you can say and this is what this new McLaren 70S project is also for. Now we signed a new contract with a new dealer for DMC and we thought um, we wanted to do something really crazy that Thailand has not seen yet. Um, the dealer brought in his own car. He has a McLaren 570S, a white one. We're gonna blend in the photo over here. So we thought, all right, why don't we make a complete makeover of the car and um, turn the whole car to carbon fiber. And this, believe it or not, has not yet been done in Thailand. Yes, there were some projects, not necessarily supercar projects, but there were some projects where people did a full carbon fiber car. But in these uh, projects, people glued on the carbon onto the existing car. But Suffice to say, this DMC project will not glue on carbon fiber. We're gonna swap the whole body where possible with carbon fiber panels. And the parts that we cannot swap, well, they probably are in carbon fiber already. So if we're looking at the McLaren 570S, probably the roof and the doors, we're not gonna touch them because anyway, they are in carbon fiber already. And all other panels, we're gonna swap them for sure. Um, our, idea, our design idea, I can already say so much, this might be a little bit much to say now for part one. In this part one video, we wanna focus on the first step, how we are welcoming the car, doing a 3D scan, doing some first designs. But I can tell you already, we're gonna take design inspirations for this Edizione GT McLaren 570S from the 600 LT, but we're not gonna stop there. While McLaren is doing regular carbon fiber, this complete car is gonna be in forged carbon fiber. So it's really, really going to be one hell of an amazing project. So uh, stay tuned for that. So um, about last week or no, two weeks ago, we started this project already. We went to McLaren Bangkok. This is where the car is parked at the moment. Our dealer has a couple of cars, so um, he doesn't have enough space at home. I think he has uh, 
uh, besides Ferraris and he has a Rolls Royce Phantom. By the way, please leave me a comment down below if you want us to do something with that Rolls Royce Phantom. And that, that has been a personal long time dream of me since the first day of DMC actually to tune a Rolls Royce Phantom. But suffice to say, one of his cars is this McLaren 570S. He hasn't even touched or driven it yet. It's still at the dealer car. It's still at their official dealership here in Bangkok. We went there and uh, took our 3D scanner and basically did a 3D scan. So that's what we, you can see probably next to me. Maybe I, I should go to the side because that day, that video, we mostly took on Instagram, um, means vertical video. And here you can see me, that's me with my handy scanner, with my uh, mobile scanner. And we're going around the car to basically convert the whole car surface into 3D data. And um, one question that always comes up again when we are showing you this kind of photos is this, why are you doing a 3D scan at all? Well, basically we need the surface of the car for two reasons. A, if we want to just carbon copy it and swap it for carbon fiber, but most important, just like for this project, we need the surface so that we can uh, figure out where what the surface looks like when we attach our newly designed parts. Um, I mentioned a little bit earlier, so we're gonna have an inspiration from the McLaren uh, 600 LT. So this is what the car is gonna look like, but not really 100%. We're gonna bring in our own DMC design elements, as you know, uh, full carbon fiber, um, basically. But stay tuned, we're gonna do a next part of the video where we're gonna give you some more details about this. Now, now we finished the scan, and uh, I would like to show you some first uh, photos, results of what that scan looks like. So probably we're gonna show it to you right here. And you see in the green area, this is the part, uh, the area uh, that we captured with our 3D scanner. Um, we're going around here and you can see already a little bit where I started to design about a potential new wing spoiler for this car. Um, more about that in a moment. So it's the front, the rear, the side. Um, let me know in the comments what do you think about this kind of development? In the beginning, when we when DMC started, we, we didn't use 3D technology, but I, I would like to say that we were actually one of the first, maybe even the first, who was pushing this 3D technology development in car tuning. Um, we've done it back even in 2012. So uh, let me know if you know anything else, but we're really proud to push this um, technology. If there's new uh, high-tech, machines coming out, we're really always one of the first to use it. So no matter ways, whether it's for capturing um, surfaces, whether it's the computers to develop new part designs, or whether it's in the production way, where we're using autoclave manufacturing to have uh, dry carbon fiber. So um, just now you saw the wing that uh, we already placed onto the 3D scan that we did. Now let's move over to the wing itself. Um, Let's take away the car. So here you can see that's the wing that I started designing. Um, I think the wing size is also is pretty nice. I'm not yet satisfied with the heights of the wing legs. I'm probably thinking whether, whether we should make them a little bit shorter or change the design overall. Right now there's too many triangles. Maybe we're gonna cut it down to, th to just two triangles in the design. But uh, the basic concept, I love it. This is gonna attach to the DMC engine hood, as you might have seen before when we showed you the car scan. Um, most companies out there, they attach it to the chassis. The problem that I have with that is um, some of them require you to make just one or two holes so that the people can drill and connect the wing legs to the car chassis. But even if it's just a hole, okay, it's not cutting, but I still don't like it. And I mentioned that many times in the DMC videos, uh, one of our car culture, one of our car design culture is that we don't like cutting cars. I also don't want to make, I also don't want to make holes into the chassis, even if it's just a small thing. It does um, affect the integrity and overall structure and strength of the chassis, so don't do it. We don't do it. Our wing attaches to the rear um, engine bonnet, which of course you can guess already it's going to be swapped by another totally different part. So all these parts from the McLaren 570S, uh, we're going to take off the car, uh, the rear engine, the front bumper, rear bumper, um, fenders, um, a lot of parts and we're going to swap them with the DMC parts. So also that um, as I just mentioned, uh, the carbon fiber engine bonnet which our wing will attach to so you don't have to drill or cut uh, your chassis or car in any way. So if for whatever reason in future you would like to sell your car 
you can actually take your old, old OEM parts, you can either store them with us or your dealership or at home and you could put them back on and most car and actually and DMC cars are being able to be reverted back to the original stock OEM look. This is one of the beautiful things that we do that you will be able to enjoy when you choose DMC uh, products. We're really proud of that and um, yes, please let me also know what you think about it. So I really hope you like this preview of this McLaren project. Um, that was part one, we're gonna continue this series. We're now in the molding process, so the parts should be ready soon. Um, there should be a part two of this video coming very soon where we're introducing you. Yeah, let's make another video first where we introduce the design, then a third part where we're gonna show you the actual parts that we manufactured, and the fourth and following parts of this series will then be how we show you to where we install these parts onto the McLaren 70S that we have here in 570S that we have here in Bangkok, Thailand. I hope you like this video. If you did like it, please leave us a thumbs up or press like button depending on the platform where you're watching this. Leave us a comment. Tell us what you liked or didn't like. Only then we can know how, you, how we can improve and give you better car content in the future. If you haven't done so yet, also please subscribe to the channel. Um, hit on that little bell icon to get notifications by the way on some other platform so let me move aside here you can do it like this you get notifications the next time when we upload new videos um, you will get a little message there's a, that there's a new DMC video you can click here exactly like that all right let me come back and um, thanks one more time for watching DMC life Hi guys, thank you so much for watching this video. There's a lot of other videos that we've done in the past actually. We're gonna blend in a couple of them over here. If you like them, why not click there also, or click there if you would like to subscribe to the channel. All these kind of things, they help us really a lot. Uh, let me say thank you one more time for watching this and I'll see you next time with more DMC content. Until then, thanks a lot.